Long wanted. Long requested. Long demanded. Long. Long. <laughs> long, long series. The final challenge of Pro and Noob is nigh as we enter the wonderful, nay, whimsical world of Capcom. Oh, look, that, that, those ruins are, have got some bad breath. <laughs> oh, okay, I thought someone was just hanging up their clothing to dry. <laughs> hey, look, it's you. This is you. That's not me. No, that's not me. Did he just have a quick fruit? I think he was just, like, throwing something at his cat. Oh, it's an apt. It's not an apt enough. It's a Tigrex. That is not an apt enough. It's a, ti it's a Tigrex. <laughs> that's a real weird looking apt enough. Hey, man, what's this strange oh, weapon thing. he's using? Is that a bug? I've never seen this before. Oh! Oh. Oh, he missed. <laughs> it, run! Like, run! What the fuck was that? So, oh, fuck. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Okay, alright. Oh. Sorry, all this is is this completely underprepared and undergeared hunter tried to attack a Tigrex, missed with everything, and is now just running from it. Well, clearly he thought it was an Aptodoth, as you said. <laughs> yeah, clearly he also thought it was an Aptodoth. Ah, oh, this is bringing back a lot of emotions. This is the first time I've felt these emotions. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, this is... Oh, I forget, this for you is marvelous. Why is the cat trying to attack the bugs? Run faster. <laughs> Look, it's imperative that they don't get in the way. This hunter is willing to sacrifice his palico to get away. Look, man, you're using an insect lab. Just jump it. <laughs> Use the pole vault. Uh, I mean, Tigrix can follow you. Now go back. <laughs> yeah, Tigrix is going to let you run by. He's, he's a good guy. Oh, shit. What a roll leap of gunmen. <laughs> roll leap of gunmen sounds like a poorly translated anime. It, it does a little bit. Oh, I got a barrel. Look out, Tigrex. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like... Oh, look, it's mounting. What's strange? That's weird. And there's barrels? What are those for? I think barrels might have been a feature before if I... And he's got a face. Oh my god, they're riding <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Look at them go. They successfully one-shot a Tigrex with two barrel bombs. I can't help but feel like the entirety of Legends of the Guild was just trying to replicate this cutscene right now. Oh, kill steal! Oh, shit. Oh, hi there. It's <laughs> so mean. It's just like, hey, thanks for this Tigrex. Yeah, I don't think they were going to kill it, honestly, given the amount of effort they took to do 300 damage. Oh, hey, so my heart can feels, feels emboldened and happy. Man, if you were struggling that much against a Tigrex, this isn't a good idea. <laughs> Monster Hunter for Ultimate! That fucking graphic had impact. That insect clave man is dead, though. He yeah, just, he just, he just leapt into Gormagala's mouth. Finally then, ladies and gentlemen... Pro and Noob for Ultimate, the only major Monster Hunter game that you have not played in any capacity, seen in any capacity, or know in any capacity. He's talking about me, not you, the audience. Yes, you, you, the cotton. And on top of just the journey itself for this wonderful game, there is 14 monsters that you have not personally fought Ooh. within its its walls. That's a lot of monsters. The name you choose may be viewed by a large number of people. Hey, you don't know how right you are for Ultimate. <laughs> All right, what's what's worse, being seen by a large number of people or a number of large people? I just love the please refrain, like someone sat here like, oh, but I really wanted an offensive name. I do like the please refrain from using something that is personal. It's like, don't use your own name. It could be dangerous. Put in your credit card number. <laughs> yep, that's that's a good one. I don't think your eyes can be big. Oh my God. Stop giving me that look. Some of them aren't, like, great, are they? Why is this one, like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill a monster. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to look. <laughs> I mean, as boring as it is, I, we're just going to go with the nice, normal, happy face. Well, maybe that's what you're going to go. Where are my red eyes? Is that the closest I can get? Jesus uh, Christ! I mean, you, you can just not have eyes. It's fine. <laughs> I don't know which is worse. Most incredible man in the world. Men want to be him. Women want him. It's the Caravaneer. I'm just gonna go out of bed on this shit. What's going on? Should I be wearing clothes? <laughs> Look, it's so stupid. I didn't want to. I didn't my weapon. Okay, man. That's me.
Is it, go is it just us on this ship? What are we? What a crazy night last night! I don't remember anything. <laughs> I swear I was wearing clothes when I went to bed. It won't be long. That's not good advice for him. <laughs> Probably not, no. <laughs> it won't be long, Hunter. Develop our pub. Pour our drinks out. We can read them before they went flat. Can't do that to the carpet here. He is legendary. Look, you can be legendary with a weird voice. Oh, yeah. This is a fun little beginning. So, obviously, as you know, we will be doing this, you know, multiplayer as you would expect for normal. But, obviously, you can't start the game like that. So, for now, I have eyes in the sky. Hi. Hello. Why did you put on a voice for that? It's just it's just you. I'm... Those ropes are having a rough time. <laughs> okay, Cotton Sky, I'm gonna go back down to normal, normal now. No, don't do it. Goodbye. No, I'm dying. <laughs> if I'm not looked at, I die. I have <sighs> reverse object permanence. Dude, we're gonna get to do a, a sand ship like Jen Moren together. That's very exciting. I've been on a sand ship before. Yeah, but we've not been on a sand ship together. Just a bit more and you can smell the Havar on the <laughs> I can smell the city from here. Being in the caravan to you. He really embraces it, you know, leading I a do, big I, old yeah. caravan. <laughs> He's just explaining his role. He's just like, I'm the <laughs> caravaneer. There's only one of me and my role is to lead the caravan. <laughs> I'm looking to recruit three more companions. Can one be you? Why am I on your ship, dude? Where did we come Who from? Who am I? What, what is this p up? <laughs> Have you seen the sky? I'm sure this will be fine and nothing at all is going wrong. Yeah, I mean, the Remobra aren't like a sign of anything, oh, generally. Oh, it's Delex. And it's Papa Delex. <laughs> oh, look at him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. There you go. There's your first new four ultimate monster. Did you like him? Yeah. <laughs> no, his hat. No! Oh, Fire the cannon. cannon! Fire the cannon! No. no, the cannon is now a cowboy. <laughs> the cannon's now a cowboy! Howdy. Ah, oh, look at him. See, this is actually a new Cabo. monster for you, so, so enjoy this. No, the this. hat again! Yeah, but I've, I've fought Daren. Thank you. Smack. I'm going to smack you. No, don't do that. What? I was afraid of that. <laughs> One moment before you get turned into paste. Oh no, I'm gonna fall off. Oh! You were supposed to steady yourself. You didn't do it. I am steadying myself. I'm in position. Steady harder. Did you find your foot? No, oh, what the my hat? Jumping Jaggy! I'm, I'm sorry, did he just realize his hat's gone? <laughs> Howdy. What's that? You're gonna try and get my hat back? No, why did you just <laughs> volunteer me? I said nothing. I just love the assumption. We've not said a word. I'll send a distress call and, oh, what's that? You're going to get my hat back? Thank that you. That is what happens when you meet someone who can't speak. You got some Duramboros sized. <laughs> well, then, that's some good information about Duramboros that I didn't know. See, aren't you glad we're finally before Ultimate? Now you know that Duramboros is massive ball. <laughs> I've always wondered. Let's go. Yeah, I feel like that's probably not the way. Now, run up its arm. You're a veneer. Have you, are you paying attention to this situation? Hey, everybody. Don't mind me, Mr. Darren. Oh, nice hat. Darren Moran. Ah, I did it. I figured out the hat get button. Buy some dime, showing up with cannonballs. You'll give me something to think about. Or put the hat in the cannon. I like the tutorial for this one. That's not how you load a cannon. See, it's a, it's a fun little introduction, though, isn't it? Instead of just it is, but I feel like town. it's not teaching you about like regular monster hunting. No, ones. no, it's not. God, I've forgotten so much about for you. I'm so excited. Honestly, for me, for you is the only pre-world game that I would consider on par with post-world. Um, is there just a chunk of him there on on the ship now? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Should we be concerned about that? <laughs> Maybe what part egg? of him is that? <laughs> That's a really great question. He just like cut off his arm at some point. Like <laughs> it's just in the ship. <laughs> it's just a lump. It's just a lump of Daren. <laughs> Yeah, that's what's gonna happen when we carve it. Lump of Darren. Criminy! He is criminy! Criminy! It's got a big attack coming! You better run that over to where I got the things and press the dash button or something. That does feel kind of right. Yeah, see? Also, the fact that the caravaneer is just standing at the front of the ship letting you do all this stuff yeah, while you're Yeah, he's actually making. not contributing in any manner, shape, or form. He's like, literally yeah, standing there crossing his arms. But at least he doesn't have his hat you. on, you know? <laughs> Talk to him. See what he has to say. <laughs> The cannonballs are at the back of the ship. Go do that. We have no clothes, man. <laughs> like, what do you want from me? Put out all the stops. Oh, yeah, it's time for the gong. You don't like loud noises. You wait near the gong switch. I'll stay up here. 
bang that gong! Oh, bonk. And thus, Darren Moran was defeated. He's dead. The perpetual sand tidal wave is very alarming in this desert. Yeah, I mean, it's a good thing you're going the exact speed you- Where are all these people coming from? Oh yeah, for you actually had proper, like, story cutscenes. It was awesome. It was the first game that they tried to do something, like, yeah. actual with the story. But also, why weren't those people helping you fight him? <laughs> they were all hiding below deck. That palico just looks like a small person in a suit. Wait a minute. Dude! Dude, you seen that? That looks like a problem. I mean, surely this isn't the first time this, ha this, this has happened. I like that they're all in identical standard issue hats. Of course. That's the hat. I mean, surely if Darren Moran just doesn't like Dodd noises, you just have a bunch of gongs set up around the perimeter. <laughs> Ow! Oh shit, a Delic. <laughs> That's why I was crossing my arms at the top. I was preparing. <laughs> oh, so it's actual hunters. Yeah, the interceptor ship. I called in the reinforcements. Look, you know him. Who's he? Julius. Yeah. Caesar. <laughs> no. Oh, he just cut his back and he's been stabbed by the times. He did have a lot of swords. <laughs> it's the uh, the Ace Hunters. This is cool. Yeah, this is where they first said hi. So this actually means that technically the first monster of 4U is Daren Moran. Yeah, I guess. I guess there you go. And welcome to Valhava, a new town. Look at all these humans. <gasps> Guild Mom! Guild Mother. Actually, <laughs> it's so much worse if you call her Guild Mother. <laughs> like the tone change between Guild Mom <laughs> and Guild Mother. <laughs> I guess it, both are better than Guild Mother. So that would be interesting, just to have a, a quest giver covered in bandages. <laughs> you gonna give him his hat back now? <laughs> yeah, sorry, what? Is that all he has to say? <laughs> Welcome to the MacGuffin. Why are you coveting that scale? We had a much bigger piece of that on the ship. It's the MacGuffin, alright? Pay attention to the MacGuffin, it'll MacGuffin later. <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> he fucking pulled out his head, he's like, rawr, and then he just looks at you for a while. <laughs> We don't believe in words here, okay? It was a roar of thanks. I think the voice we gave him to begin with was more accurate to ah, that. Ah, Valhava with the frog flames. Oh, the frogs, where are the frogs? Oh, cat chefs. Oh yeah, the Wiporium. There he is, the Wiporium. Quagga carts. Oh. Careful, Carbonia. I gotta dump you right here in the Capital C Caravan. Capital C Caravan. Why is that? Pelico, like, go, Quagga, go. Yeah, Quagga, go. The ra they're racing the other <laughs> cart that went by 20 seconds ago. We've traveled the world already, and now we've come in companion number one. A cook. A merchant. A merchant. A hunter. A hunter. Maybe that might be us, sir, please. No, no, no way. You're pretty shit, actually. I like that he called that a fairy to get here. There was only us. Nobody was driving <laughs> it, but supposedly him, I guess. And then also, it was attacked by a giant fucking monster that we had to fight. That's not a fairy ride. <laughs> Imagine saying no. Actually, you know, it's... I mean, it's try fine. it. See what happens. But what if he rejects me? No, he'll say, haha, you're joking, right? Yep. Before you get to the meaty quest, though, you have to finish my meaty quest. Please don't say that. A quest for <laughs> me. <laughs> Please don't say that, Caravidia. What? He gave you a sword and shield. You're a sword and shield main now. So what are your first impressions of, of Valhabar? Looks very nice. I imagine it, there's not a whole lot of explorable area, but it looks very this nice. This is one of the towns I most want to get a modern monster hunter. Oh, yeah, no. This looks like it would be great and modern, yeah. I love the epic frog flame path to the gathering hall. We're on fire! Help us! Please come this way! Quests and frogs away! Please! It burns! Welcome to the gathering hall, where we have the world! Oh my god, it's the world's smallest cowboy! It is, it's little cowboy Wyvarian! God, I forgot this as duty. well! It's so good! Because oh. my memories from For You, not to spoil anything, are of Dundorma. I had completely forgotten Valhabar. I don't know what that is. Look at the big globe. Yeah, it's awesome. Is that actually a map of the Monster Hunter world? Can we decipher that? <laughs> it's been years. Some say he died. Some say he never existed at all. Some have even forgotten. But now, it returns. Gotten stupid face! Hi. Hi, stupid face. You may not like this, but this is the peak male body. Oh, this is very exciting! Woo! Honestly, you know, this might be up there as the best 
as the best gathering hub in in the pre pre fifth gen era. Oh, I thought you were gonna say the best cotton. Yeah, I think this is a pretty solid. This cotton. might be up there as the best co cottoning hub. I mean, it's GU cotton, but he's got a mustache, a little smug mustache, so it, it is pretty up there for me. Smug mustache. Hello, Daddy Cowboy. Every corner is designed for maximum hunter enjoyment. We've got a metric monster dung ton of cotton. <laughs> But why did he have to say it like that? I know headbutting Jaggy is a heck of a more fun than reading. Thanks, Gray. I'm so glad I spoke to you. Really, uh... Ah, oh, here we are with our glowing food attack. So obviously this is the game, the gen, the game. that first introduced. Charge blades and insect glaive. Yeah. Wait, yes. Oh, sorry. It was an area transition. I got confused. <laughs> that does happen. Suddenly everything goes dark and it's like, whoa. I wasn't ready for darkness. Same, man. I, I get you. <laughs> Why do you make? Just answer the question. Don't make fun of me. I didn't hear the question. What you said was... <laughs> Well, you're supposed to interpret me better than that, okay? What I understood was, are we the same? And I said, same. <laughs> You'll have to let me know. I'm capturing this app enough. What you think of original, original charge blade? I will once I know. What are they? Are they? Are they supposed to be Kelby? Oh no! You mean the gig the fucking gigantic Kelby in the distance? Yeah, like they they are, they are supposed to be Kelby, right? But they're absolutely massive. Yeah, for how far away those things are way too and they're big. Chunky as well, like I. That's uh, this ain't right. This they're ain't like right. they're like gifts. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god! No, look! I they mean, are absolutely yeah, massive! Look how big they're right are! There. They're fucking giant! God, I'd forgotten how, uh, how much of an experience it can be just, just finding the monster. Are you sure there's a monster? I, I don't know. Maybe we're just having a lovely tour of this lovely map. I do like Jaggy and Jaggy. Ah! Found the monster! Hey, hang on, you explain how the target cam worked? Okay, thanks, Caravania. This no. is not the time. This is really distracting. It's like, hey, if I wait yeah. till you're about to do, you know, a fight against a monster and then tell you pages of information, that seems like the appropriate time, right? I'm not even paying a single moment of attention to what he said. I have no idea what he's told me. All I know is we have defense down collectively. I'm having an issue whereby I'm pressing the wrong buttons. I keep all I the keep time. blocking what I mean to mean to sheave. Yeah, yeah, I keep blocking what I mean to sheave. <laughs> We played this too many versions work. of similar games with similar buttons. Okay, I have files. All I right, let it let something. it happen, man. Come on, you can do well, it. I, mean, I, I, do, I don't even know what the animation is. I know it's not the same thing. Oh, it's Show. just that. Okay, it's that one. It's been a long time since I fought a Celtus. Why did you place him in a nest? It's easier for me. <laughs> I like it when he's in a little rock hard uh, nest. Huh? Huh? Oh my god, I do have this attack in, in this game. Ah! You targeted the me instead of the him, you fool! No, no, no. I, I targeted the him when he was on the ground, but then he got up and you were standing there. I feel very purple. Well, you should probably get some other colors in there. I don't understand! The color man came and went and didn't explain his choices. Understandable. We didn't paintball him. No, we didn't. Can't. You, you have one job. No, I don't. That's been you for ages because you usually take all the paintballs. You are the utility belt. This has been long established. Only when I'm allowed to, and as, I've, as I have established, I did not go to the item chest. If you were to exist around Batman, you would spend your time wrapped around his waist. I mean, probably, but that's irrelevant to the conversation. <laughs> However, as I've already stated, I did not go to the item box at the start of this ha! quest, so you have the paintballs. I've refound him. To be fair, a belt with arms mm. that can pass you things is a really, like, is a really good idea. Terrifying though. concept. It's not terrifying. Like, oh, I need my, my pocket item because, you know, we don't want to name anything specific. No, and it's like, not. here you go. I mean, maybe not have a voice. That might make it a little bit too creepy. But, like, and then it passes it up to you. Okay, so it's not creepy if it doesn't talk. Well, I mean, it's definitely, it's definitely creepier if your waist talks, grows arms, and passes you an apple. I don't know. It's creepy no matter what, in my opinion. They'll probably don't keep an apple. <laughs> you son of a bitch! You need, you're banned from charge blade. I mean, what? I hit the monster, and then you got upset with me. You knocked me into the air with your SAD! You cancelled my charge! I didn't know that. You were behind the monster. I think the problem here is that you don't have flinch free yet. <laughs> oh, sorry, I forget. I needed that in my starter armor with you here. I don't know what the damage values are, obviously, but I have to charge my shield every time I do that, which is bad. Well, both charge blade and set blade were incredibly good at the uh, at their launch. I mean, it's not like they've got terrible now, but they were very yeah, good. Yeah, because I imagine that one might be better. 
And Far You was the was the introduction of proper verticality and climbing and jumping oh, and yeah. mounting and mounting. all of that good stuff. Mountains. Yes, it was the introduction of mountains. We didn't have any mountains before. What is a mountain, anyways? I've definitely found the way that I'm supposed to play this, just based on his reactions. You mean his unconscious still body? Well, I made him flinch quite a few times as well, so... I think, I, I think I've worked out the way I'm supposed to be doing that. Well, if we just keep him in place and then keep hitting him... Then we win! <laughs> he stunned again! What?! I have found the way to play- I have found the way to play Charge Blade. <laughs> How did you get a second stun in like five seconds? At the start. Because I'm really good at Charge Blade, apparently. I really thought you were going to say, Because I'm ripped. Because I'm ripped and I punched him in the face. <laughs> I just use my muscles. Am I going the right way? Don't you have a map? Put the map on your main screen. I didn't go to the box. Oh, you literally did. Oh. How many times do I have to say I didn't go to the freaking box? What? I don't see him. Am I being dumb? Yep, he's not here yet. He must be. He got here way before. No, he just landed on top of me. I'm scared. Sorry, I'm scared. It's on I'm scared. I'm so low, but I don't want to use any more potions. Okay. It's all right. I got this. I feel Bang. like you're not, you're not appreciating the the scary time I'm having. Well, I had a scary time, but I just used a potion. You, you see, your scary die! time. Die! Why won't you die? You st oh, I thought he had to be died. avoided by just using a potion. So I don't feel bad for you. Oh. oh! My game just like lagged for half a second, and then it was zoomed in on my face. All right, Celtus. You know, if we could just gently does it. Oh no, I didn't put my hand in! Oh, I'm yeah, so that, that sorry! Like a very poor idea. How did he not react to this? Okay, okay, uh, let me- Oh god, I put the rest of my body I'm in! I'm concerned about what's happening right now over there. I don't really have a- <laughs> Oh no, he woke up! He woke up! Why are you sat on me? <laughs> I'm sorry, Zelda, I didn't know how to make you away. Where are you going? Uh, he's running from me because I'm here what? now. Why did a conchu just do that kind of damage to me? It's a conchu. We're, we're one star hunters, man. We're arguably not even that yet until we finish <laughs> we're this. One star hunters. <laughs> also, we didn't put our helmets back on, so we're missing like one defense. That yeah, that that would not help. I mean, one defense is a lot when you have five defense. <laughs> We're missing like 20% of our yeah. total defensive value. <laughs> you know how crazy that is? It's not a good choice, I don't think. You think he's going to die? Maybe hey, at man. some point. I mean, that would indicate the success of the quest. It would make me feel a little bit better with a tiny little rush of end endorphins. No, 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 sir. Yes! Oh, here we go. Yeah! Oh, yeah. You sounded so unenthused. Yeah. I didn't say that. I said, oh, yeah. What are you buying? I was looking to see if she had any blue mushrooms so I could make potions. Why is she like the intensity of a devil chosen ending hunger? Grr! Understandable, really. You really don't sell normal potions yet? Nope. Go for you. Still use the book of combo system? I really yep. thought they'd grown past that by this point, but no. No, it was in GU too. I'm pretty sure. God, what a, what a trip. Oh, doodle. I've this being called Doodle! What is this? Spun are you Doodle Bob? Oh. Is this SpongeBob? You shut up! I'm talking to the best character in all of Monster Hunter and fellow Brachydios enjoyer, Guild Mom! Uh, I mean, I, I just can't believe you. I'll open up again once you're done hunting with your friends! Oh, gotta finish hunting with your friends. Sorry, Guild Mom. I realize, I realize if we are going to interact, it needs to be, you know, entirely focused. We can't have Cotton here. Well, yeah, because I also need to interact with her by myself. <laughs> Hey, quest of tricks! Give me more quest of trickses! Who shall we next kill? Mmm... You? I found the frog. Frog? That's a spoiler. Hey, man. Ow. Oh, <laughs> like you arrived like, whoa! <laughs> oh my god, that did so much damage. Oh, we may have made a huge mistake. What do you mean we? You're the one in charge of these events. As long as we don't get hit by anything and kill him, we'll be okay. But that's up. I'm gonna kill him. If you just, like, one-shot him! <laughs> Hmm. Don't underestimate Charge Blade. I remember Charge Blade being strong, but that seems uh, seems a bit much. Knock him out with tail hits. Well, that would require him not to have a rock in his face. So. Or in his pocket. <laughs> Why are you like this? <laughs> That's so mean. That's excessively mean. Yeah, it's not like you've ever said that to me in the past. I've never said that to you untruly. I've always meant it. <laughs> Yeah, no, I, I know. I know you've meant it. That's not a surprise. Oh, I accidentally had too much first aid med. Now I'm overpepped. Oh. How am I supposed to deal with being overpepped? Eat a trank bomb. 
Oh, my iron pickaxe broke. I got an aquaglow jewel, though. And an earth crystal, though. And an iron ore. Good, I needed that. With iron ore comes power. With power, a future. With a future, a past. What? No, that's not how that works. You don't control time. No, I don't. You're right. You control oregano. Okay, so you just go around mining, and it just it just doesn't attack you at all, <laughs> but I start mining. He's like, I'll accept it once, Rivet, but I won't accept it twice, Frog Noises. I wonder if that has anything to do with the fact that you were right next to me while I was trying to do it. You shouldn't mine in the middle of combat, otherwise you get punished for it, you fool. I disagree. You should know better by now. You've had many hunting journeys. I don't know better. This is your final hunting journey. I'll, I'll set you free into the wild after this. You'll find you'll finally be ready. There will be more monster hunters. No, 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 no. You don't you don't get to play Monster Hunter 6. You, this is it for you. I'm sorry. Well, at least I know now. I spoke to the guild and they've like they've, they've had enough of, of Yeah, they're trying to promote me. I understand. I'm so Tetsu. Oh, I got the first mountain for you. Oh, I thought he was leaving. I thought you said he was leaving. He is. I'm in the next zone mounting him. Oh, you should have waited for me. Yay, I failed the first round of for you! No, I've not failed the first round of for you! Oh, I brought it right back at the end! Good question mark? I'm confused. That was tense. That was an emotional journey I just went on. Oh, and I just killed two Bahabra in one swing. I am mighty. I'm solid. feeling good. I want to look into a mirror and do a double <laughs> finger point at myself. Are you struggling to, like, navigate? Is that what's I happening? I know exactly where I am and where I need to go. <laughs> I can't tell if you said that in a way that means you don't do either of those things in reality. No, I'm trying to get mushrooms and I'm getting beat up by some fucking jaggies. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being well, honest. Well, it was only about the mushrooms <laughs> until about five seconds before that, but now they need to fucking die. Really hard to hit jaggies with a charge blade, I'll tell you that much. Imagine how crazy First Mountain Monster was. I mean, it was. Yeah, mount mountains are weird. Boy, he's very special for me. It was the the game I put by far the most hours into until obviously World and onwards. And it's the one Monster Hunter game that I ha that, that that is on the channel. Like even before before you got involved, there's just a random Monster Hunter video of me fighting two uh, Rajang Look in, you. in 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 for you at the end game, and I was having a great time. Well, I'm glad that you were having fun. Hey, Hi. Hey, man. That's not the noise people normally make when I enter. Why did you just annihilate that bat? <laughs> you arrived and absolutely it was, crushed it. And that fact I that mean, Tetsu was like, well, I don't want to be anywhere near that. So you just, you just going away? Okay. <laughs> hey, Hannes, he went that well. Not you two again. Why? <laughs> Sorry, did they just arrive like, that's the guy that stole our mushrooms. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Cotton, why are you a jaggy criminal? Look, I needed the mushrooms. They make potions. By the hair on our chin, we broke his. I don't think it was the hair that did that. I think it was the, the metal weapon. The tortoise? No. Who'd win in a fight? A hair or a tortoise? The tortoise, because the hair couldn't do anything to It'd it. It'd be a really lame fight, wouldn't it? Like, as, as far as... Well, yeah, I mean, neither of them is particularly offensively capable, but the turtle will just last Maybe that's longer. what we need. Illegal underground animal fights, but it's really lame animals that can't really hurt each other and the fight's like really anticlimactic and tame. You're talking about a really weird petting zoo. I don't think a petting zoo is a combat arena. I don't think the children go in and the goats are like, Arr! You misunderstand how children act. <laughs> are we talking kids or kids? Well, both in this case. <laughs> kids versus kids. B business write down. That is the one. You pay to watch kids versus kids. Like pay per view. Why would I? I run the business with you. <laughs> yeah, you manage the kids, and I'll manage the kids. This feels a bit out of our out of our depth at the moment. Yeah, but he's all his parts are broke. We've got so much damage in. Oh yeah, except I can I cannot hit him right now. He moves too much when it's <laughs> like this. My concern is that I'm one attack away from being killed by pretty much anything he does. So I've got to really choose. Realistically, I am too, to be honest with you. I've got to really choose my moment here. Oh! oh we got a sub quest. We supplies! Go. Supplies! Got in supplies! I'm going back for supplies. Let's go get supplies. Yeah, okay, I mean, there's only enough for one person. That's how that works. So I guess I'll yeah, stay but here. Yeah, can still go in the bed and at least get a top. Up. I, I, I have an herb if I want that little bit. All right. I just I framed a roar. I'm not in danger. All right, Walt White. What? That's not the line. <laughs> you sound just like him. <laughs> <laughs> like you, you weren't quite ready for that. <laughs> We're not in danger, Skylar. <laughs> so I'm glad we went back for supplies then. We might actually pull this out of the bag. We will. I'm here, you son of a gun. Oh, careful, he's jumping. He's a frog. Oi! Oh, I missed. He's just sort of looking at me. 
Okay, he was two hits from death when we walked away. <laughs> of course he was. Amazing. I am very much in danger. Good job, team. We killed Tetsu. And as we all know, Tetsu is the best progression armor set. So now we can get Tetsu. Do we know that? Yeah, it's just very solid. It has defense okay. and health up, and it, and it, it just makes you... That is pretty you... good. Yeah. I'll be honest, I don't feel like we're struggling for damage here, so I'm good with that. No, exactly. That's why I'm saying we just we need to not be getting splatted by every attack. No, that's probably because Charge Blade is, uh, is, you know, it's an okay weapon, unless you're as good at it as I am, <laughs> within five minutes of playing it in this game for the first time. That's crazy how you've picked up Charge Blade so fast. It's like you somehow knew, it like, just, the it basics makes, It just makes so much weapon. sense. Before well, the thing, well, you say that, but I've chosen a, a play style that you would never use with modern charge blade, and it just seems to be doing well. So you know, I'm sticking with it. All right, now that I've cast the pink menace from my world, I left of my own accord. I've cast him from my world. There's totally tons of caravans out there, apparently. Did the boss mention new hunter? I guess I could go check with him, but that would be awkward. So yeah, sure, I'll, I'll give you quests. <laughs> Oh, guild mom. Let's get down to business, Doodle. Can I call you Doodle? <laughs> yes. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. Oh, the glorious ancestral steppening. I admire your enthusiasm for my steak. What, Caravanee? I don't see that in public. <laughs> Apt enough. Don't worry. They're timid and harmless. Don't worry. They're innocent, terrified animals, and you're about to slaughter them for me. Normal, innocent Apt enough. Just striding up with death in our eyes. The Aptonoff looks at us like, is that, is that a problem? Oh my God, it's a problem, guys! Run! Silly vegetable, vegetables, vegetarian. Vegetable? Vervivores, vegiv, fucking. Vervivore, virgin, <laughs> stupid virgin Aptonoff. <laughs> <laughs> I bet they've never fucked. I just like the silly vegetables in this field. Uh, give me your meat so I can spit on it or something. <laughs> so I may be, I, I may be killing some Aftonoth, and it, it, it freeze frames you to give you information at certain points. I've got a really solid one right now. Oh my god, the freeze frame is the massive yep, splat yep. of blood on top of the Aftonoth! Yeah, with the carbon ingrate! Oh yeah, that's the good <laughs> stuff! <laughs> that's so brutal! Thing is, this is so very specifically an Aptonoff family. Like, th there's a baby, and then a, a big, big one, and a small, big one. Just had a nice interaction where I put some raw meat on a spit, took it off pretty quick, and it's like, that's still raw meat, idiot. <laughs> it's raw now. Or sorry, it's rare now. Well done, steak! Ha <laughs> ha! Destroyed, Con. You didn't even cook it enough. Well, I, I wasn't told to, that I had to deliver a well-done steak, and I prefer my steak rare. Yeah, but they didn't ask yeah. for rare, not blue. It was blue at first, and then I reared it. You see that red box? That's the That's delivery box. box. Put your steak in that box. Okay. Whatever you request, Guild Mother. I did it, Caravania. I roasted your meat. That meat looks beastly. Oh, oh dang, it is beastly. Bring me a mega potion any way you can. I'll have you know, I already have all of the ingredients for one. I don't have any honey. Where did you get honey a from? A bee nest? It's a hive? You don't even know what it is and you got some? I don't need to know. I'm a hunter, not a writer. <gasps> crazy. It's guild mom jumping! Because the quests are now open! Guild mom jumping is my favorite song. Guild mom jumping! Woo! -hoo! These quests look really challenging. Yep, I'm sure they do. I'm sure it's harder than what we've been doing. God, I really, like, look at, wow. Wow, look at all that. How do we, how do we even? It's impossible. No one could do that. How are we supposed to do these quests, man? Nobody could do it. I'm like actually a little bit scared. Not a single hunter could ever complete unique mushrooms. Like, how do you find five unique mushrooms? Two right? of them like, have to look similar. Like, yeah, like that's so ridiculous. How would we ever do that? All right then, ladies and gentlemen, that is for ultimate officially started. And it's over. That's the last That's it. episode. That's one episode. It's just a one-off special. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. It was a nice Celtus and Tetsukabra. Yay. Uh, we'll uh, we'll um, perhaps spin through a few of these basic Caravania quests for the sake of everyone's sanity. And uh, we'll see you. We'll see you next time. Like if you enjoyed this, we'll see you subscribe and hit the bell for more, or consider supporting the future of the channel on Patreon down below. And until we meet again, oh god.
Bye. Goodbye. Josh, Cotton, and Hollow with the videos. Dropping the humor like a hammer on your tippy toes. Bringing entertainment on a daily arrangement to take our insanity and turn it into entertainment. Yes, I said entertainment twice. To reiterate that it is nice. To look into your faces on a mostly daily basis when you let us in your homes to make the whole world a stage. Is, uh, goodbye.